I'd like to talk a little bit about your assignment called What's Your Story? America has a story, and each of us have a story. The point we'd like to prove right now is that if you take everybody's story in the whole country and put them all together, that's how you get America's story. So we're going to spend a little bit of time with your story. Who are you? What are some things about you? You know, you live your life every day. Um, everything is so normal to you that maybe you don't even realize um, that other people who live around you are very similar, but also have some differences. And, you know, maybe even though we all are going to live in the Hanover area and you're all basically the same age group, um, you go to the same school, you may attend some of the same dance studios, sports teams, churches, whatever it is. Well, our lives are a little bit different from each other. So let's spend a little bit of time with what's your story? The paper you see on the screen right here um, is one that you'll be able to open in another link here in a little bit. And the idea is you're going to fill out some information about yourself. Uh, as you do that, please put your name, uh, enter your name or type your name into this box. And if you're a uh, class period two, four, or excuse me, two, six, or eight, make sure you put that in this box. Or if you're distance learning, put a DL in there. And so maybe you'll tell me a few things about yourself. Maybe an elementary school you went to. Maybe a favorite teacher you had in elementary. It's okay if it's not in the Southwestern School District. Um, some things about your, some of your preferences about uh, candy or junk food that you might like or a favorite food, you know, that kind of thing. Uh, maybe some goals you have for after high school someday. Uh, just, you know, to kind of give you an idea here, let me show you what mine looks like. I fill this out about me. Uh, so there's a few things about me. Like I have three siblings. Uh, I have one dog. I like uh, some uh, sports. Uh, gee, I'd sure like to try being a Powerball winner someday. That sounds like it might be a lot of fun. You know, so there's some, uh, you know, some examples of what you're doing and telling part of your story. And our whole philosophy in American culture's class is that everybody's story put together makes America's story. You might even be surprised uh, when we compare ourselves to other kids in just your class, uh, how much we are similar, but also how we're different. I often tell a story about uh, going to spend a night at a friend's house when I was in high school, and they just lived life very differently than I did at my house. I went to his house on a Friday night, and well, I asked him, what are we gonna do? And he was like, well, nothing. Well, my family is always running around, always doing all kinds of stuff. Uh, it seems like we were never home. We were always out doing things. And so when I went to my friend's house and they weren't going to do anything, it was just hanging out. Well, that was kind of a surprise to me. You know, even though I was friends with this kid, we had been friends for several years. And, but, you know, just a different lifestyle. So that's the idea of what's your story. We put everybody's story together. We have America's story. So go ahead and open the link uh, to this document which is on your uh, list of uh, your daily activity or weekly activities, and tell me a little bit about you and your story.